Hey guys, this is Chris and welcome back. Today, I have another mystery bag that we are gonna open up. And like with the other videos, I'm going to uh, open up the bag, show you what's inside it, and then we'll do some research and then come back for the second part of the video, just in case there's something really worthwhile in these bags. So, so far, just haven't had much luck um, as far as value goes, but you know, for a $5 bag of books, you get five books, eh, it's worth a shot. All right, start off, we have Gru, the Wanderer, number 43, all the way back from 1988. It's actually one that's not in bad shape. Not in bad shape at all. Don't know if these are worth anything, but that's what we'll, uh, we'll figure out after. All right, next up, let's see. We have the Demon from DC, number 11. This one's in really rough shape. Kind of a funky little color there, cover there. Again, no idea. We'll have to do some research and figure it all out. All right, next up, we have ooh, Justice League of America, number 59. This one looks pretty good, from 1992. That one out. Three. Actually, more in this. Huh? Maybe not. Next up is Batman and the Outsiders. Number 27. This one's in really rough shape. Oh my goodness. This definitely looks like it came from like a, a long box somewhere. I mean, look at that. This has been sitting around for really quite a while. I have no idea where they got these books, but. This is definitely uh, one to be read, that's for sure. A lot of creases, a lot of, a lot of damage on that one. And then finally, we have X-Force, number 20. Check that out. All right, so what I'm gonna do is gonna go check out prices and see if they're worth anything. And in the second part of the video, uh, we'll reveal that. We'll be back. All right, guys, we're back. So really, Gru the Wanderer, only worth a couple of bucks. Demon, maybe a dollar. Justice League of America, maybe two bucks. Um, this one, Batman and the Outsiders, actually would have sold for more money if I think it was in better condition, but it's really, really rough with some staining on the back and it's got crease, but it is a newsstand. So if anybody wanted a newsstand for really cheap, this would be the one. Um, and X-Force. Yeah, not worth too too much but you know overall dollar dollar bin books for the most part just never know well that's it for this one uh hopefully you will join me again for our next unboxing uh it's sure to be a good time so maybe we'll have better luck in the next one um until then have a great day talk to you soon